Hello, you. Flimbo's Quest is one that's been sitting on the shelf there for I don't know how long and I haven't got round to um, playing yet. But then, I mean, yeah, I was never sure. That always looked a bit freaky to me. That, all cute and fun and everything. That's not right. Hmm. Where's the light switch? There we go. Yeah, he says, and then, I don't know, maybe you want to see inside the box. Very squeaky plastic inside. It seems to say E. No idea why. Manual feels like it's printed on a modern laser printer, but I know it wasn't, because it, I've had this for 20 odd years, or however long it is, I know. So if you ever buy a copy on eBay, I'd say, you go, ooh, hang on, this looks like a dodgy printed, knocked up version, so it's not quite complete. No, no, it looks like the original manual just feels like it was printed on a laser printer. <laughs> Modern laser printer, though, weird. Anyway, yeah. We've reached the end of side A. So we have to rewind side B to get the levels. I thought I'd at least save you the beginning bit and show you this nice picture in tune. Aren't I nice? Ooh, there we go. And as soon as I press play, it's going to uh, go away, isn't it? Yep. <laughs> so there we are. Yes, nice little, um, nice little tune and picture. Uh, 90, July 10th, 1990, the uh, price label on the back. <laughs> July 10th, 1990, 9.99. Yes, I can't remember. System 3, I can't remember who was it who wrote this now. Was it Twiddy? Uh, doesn't say anything in the manual. Just some guff about a fiendish Professor Franz Dandruff. <laughs> oh, comedy names. You're in Dewdrop Land, your name is Flimbo, your girlfriend's name is Pearly. Daz Bazian is the bloke who runs the shop. No idea where that came from. Uh, you collect scrolls, scrolls gives you letters, and letters make words. Super scrolls give you a complete word. You want to get a word, something like getting off the level or something. Ah, there we go. So that would be a scroll. That would be a contains word of mystery. So that's a word, right? Yeah, we'll go with music on and sound effect on. It doesn't seem as cute there, does it? It's, it's nice graphics, and very good um, presentation on there. Uh, ooh, lack of apostrophe there. Ooh, tut tut. But, uh, oh, that moth, we got one at the top. Hmm. Oh, cable wrapped around all things here. Yeah. <laughs> right. All I can remember is it was like a cute version of Hawkeye. And I've played it through to completion. I can't remember the ending. I'll have to look that up. Now, where am I going to look up a load of C64 endings? Hmm. Okay, let's. Uh, <clears throat> Again. Oh, that's Daz Bazian then, is it? I was by the shop and I pressed up and <laughs> took it to the shop. I've got no money. Uh, I'm assuming that's exit. Yes. That's not, that's not something to pick up then. Right, I need definitely need faster firing. I picked up of some kind. All oh, right, I've got to get that dragon. Ah, it's that one that's flashing then. Mm, auto buy doesn't work too well on this. Hey, I got him. What does that mean? I've got to get another one just like him. It looks nice. It's very pretty graphically. Very brown, you might say as well. But a bit stippled and a bit. I don't know, um... Oh, he didn't die, he walked into the edge and died, was it? Oh, well, let's kill this one then. Right. A little muted, shall we say. Which I know people can accuse the 64 of all the time, but I've never really noticed it. 
and now people have mentioned it, now I have kind of noticed it on this. So thanks for that. Right, okay, I've got a hundred. Um, I don't know how much these things cost, because you're not telling me. Oh, hang on, sorry, it's saying that's top. I was looking at my money and looking down there. Oh, dear. Oh, yes, you guessed it, I'm tired. Um, well, I can't afford anything, can I? But I thought it was best to go back to the shop, seeing as it said something about you can only carry one thing at a time. So I thought, well, I'd better go and drop it off at the shop then. Maybe I did. Maybe it's done that already. Can I go in there? Ooh! <laughs> Realise that one is uh, supposed to do this like bomb jack, am I? And I've completely bolted that up. Oh well. Yeah, what if there are any other doorways that I missed? Right, I've got that's right. I've got a scroll. So yeah, so I take that back to the shop, and then it will tell the next one that I need to kill. It does music. Thing about it's just it's kind of nice but ah letter thanks Linda. right okay did you say that last time i just didn't notice still can't afford anything can i 350 250 oh well 2500 oh just one of them oh but a particular one of one of those isn't it? the firing seems a little i don't know you can't kind of have to stop to fire, so it's not quite run and gun. Oh, that was silly. What was I thinking? And if you just hold down fire, it doesn't seem to... Mind you, I've got to remember, this is the first crappiest weapon in the game, isn't it? So, aha, there you are. bullets here for you, open wide. Lovely. Is it any safer running along the top of the screen? He says jumping to the point where he jumped last time and died. <clears throat> Assuming heart is health. Right, so that should... Oh, I picked up the heart and that... Oh, oh right, I gotcha. That cocked it up right at the end there, didn't it? <sighs> Don't pick up the heart, although I suppose... Does that, do I have hit points? Or is it a one hit you're dead deal? So what's a heart? Is a heart an extra life? Right. Don't go picking anything else up. That's not happening, is it? Uh, what's up with my joystick? No, no, we're okay. Left seemed to be a bit squiffy then. Right. And I've not picked anything else up. There we go, I didn't drop the letter this time. What are those hearts up there all about? got 330, so what What was it that I could afford? Uh, something. I don't know what that is. I know it's 250. I, I'm going to leave it because I'm going to pick up the weapon and do that I think is that one. When I can afford it, it shouldn't be too much longer. What was that? Ah. Oh, I've gone green. I'm expecting that's not good. But, um, he's going with it. Oh, right, there we go. Right. Coins were okay picking up. I don't know, this weapon just feels 
Oh, I picked something up, didn't I? Again, then. I don't remember any any level bosses or anything like that. Is it just running left and right all the time? It could, could get a little bit like, on the same side. Hmm. Right. Level completed. Ooh, and we're loading already. Ooh, cup of tea then. Chin chin. Nice touch loads in while I, still, I can't move, but that's a good place to do it. And lovely thing about the Commodore 64, isn't it? The tape drive just takes over, does its own thing. You don't have to keep rushing back to stab stop on it. <laughs> it's loaded in the next level, like on the Spectrum. <sighs> Ooh, we're back. Cool. What's that there? Well, shoot it. No, that was background, right. Um, well, I've got 390. That's 350. Let's have that. Oh, look, goes further, eh? Oh, and I dare say that's more powerful as well. Thank you. A green froggy type thing. Let's see what's in there. Is anything in there? No, I can't go in there. Yeah, this is more like it now. Persevere for the first. I wonder how I actually use this heart thing, or is it. Mm, mm, I'm not sure. Ooh, can I go in here? Yes, I can. Cool. Oh, almost forgot. Let's try and. We'll try and get some of them in. And I'll look back later. Uh, no. Well, I'll have to get that one. Yeah. Right, so pink one's got me 20. Did the other ones only get me 10 then? Yeah, persevere through the first level. And you get to go a bit more gung ho. I, mean, I don't remember any of the other later levels. Or any bosses or anything. Oh! Well, that wasn't very nice. Don't say I've lost my. Oh. Still, in that little rampage, I've made enough to get it again. <laughs> cool. He came out of there, didn't he? Ah, shoot the heart and it turns green and does you harm. I gotcha. Nice. And uh, back to the shop. Right. Uh, now, where's... Oh, we'll I'll grab that coin while we're going past. There he is. Just luck of the draw as you go the right, right way for the beast you're having to get. Okay, so he didn't pop out this time, that's good. A dragon. We need to find a dragon. And... Ooh, fishies. Dead fishies. Uh, yeah, I can get that heart alone, can't I? Oh, balls. That was a slip of the joystick. Oh crap, I'm back with crappy weapon again, aren't I? Oh, how irritating. Oh, coins. Right. 230. 250. 255. Ah, so they're worth four times as much. Worth getting them when they're pink, then. I 
someone's going to make a joke about the pink pound away. Green sterling pink pound, I don't know. Uh, now, who was I supposed to be shooting? Oh, hang on, we've got another doorway. to go for over there have I so back we go saying anything here am I because I'm just oh goody weapon time thank you um, yeah, super scroll da, 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 da. what are the hearts I'm gonna have to look that up aren't I why is it only when I'm recording that my phone decides yep yeah, I'll sound an alert silent all day <laughs> leave it on my desk set the camera up and it chirps Ah well. Right, where is this dragon that I'm supposed to be? Where is he? Uh. Right, so I've been all the way over to the left. Oh! Where the hell have you been? Right. And you can have some as well. Probably one more letter needed this level then, I'm guessing, is it? Uh, one of those green guys. Doo -doo 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 -doo. I used to have a poster. Actually, I used to have several posters of this game. Uh, the local computer game shop used to sell off the posters, like a quid for a roll of ten random ones and you generally get at least two Flimbo's Quest posters. <laughs> or if you are extra fancy fans you could pay two pounds uh, for something like the um, huge um, uh, Golden Axe poster that uh, I've got in the living room to annoy the wife with. <clears throat> Big man in pants in the living room, it's great. Uh, how long have we been? Hmm, almost 20 minutes, blimey. But yeah, considering um, it's such an awful, freaky cover, why on earth? I, I actually did still put them up. I still put them up on the walls, even though it's such a weird picture. Uh, but, uh, yeah, so I wonder what happened to those. <laughs> I think they were probably chucked. So if you see any Flimbo's Quest posters about there, out there now, oh, they're going to be very rare. They really weren't at the time. <laughs> oh, cup of tea. Cup of tea, cup of tea. Mm. We're to be back. Right, ooh. Mm. Exploding. Raptor walks into a wall and explodes. It is very pretty, but it is somewhat repetitive, isn't it? How much money have I got? Not enough. Oh, and I've already got that anyway. Okay, uh, but who am I killing now? Okay, well, we will try and clamber up to here then. Ooh, money! We're supposed to kill a rat. Ooh, brilliant. Um, damn you. Uh, <laughs> I 
and back across again. Okay. Uh, and there's the last one. There we go. That wasn't a bad haul, was it? Uh, that's where I die falling over to a hole and don't get to spend it. Oh, for heaven's sake. <gasps> oh, I can't believe I pre-narrated myself doing that. I was joking. I was just meaning it would be Sod's Law, wouldn't it? And of course, Sod's Law bloody happened. Oh well. Oh, come on, left. Yes, I think I need to switch. First thing to give Mr. Clicky a bit of a rest. I think the left, the left seems a little weak. Got that other one to try, so I can try that. Rewind to tape and press play, and then we load in the first level again then. Ah, but I will leave it there for now on this one. That's more than enough of me wittering on about Klimbo's quest. <clears throat> and not talking much while I was actually playing it, I suspect. Hey-ho! There we go, yeah, Klimbo's quest. It's nice enough, it's very pretty, it's very well made, but oh, there was always something about it that didn't quite grab me and made me think, you just walking left and right and collecting. Hmm... Very nice though, and doable. I did it, um, and I just made, was that level 3 on my first go in decades? Yeah, give it a go. See what you think. Hey, anyway, thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Maybe catch you on the next one. Ta-ta.